Hi. I promised a virtual garden tour a while ago, and I think this morning is going to have to be it because we're pretty close to end of season. I have a Serrano. I have a handful of the last cherry tomatoes that I think we're going to get out of this. And uh, I wanted to show you a strawberry. Oh, can I get this with some slugs? They have eaten my perfect strawberry. Oh, come on. Come on. There we go. But I will let them because I think they're super cute. Oh. Really. I don't know why. I just... They're little... They're little heads. They're little, like, wobbly. Alright, garden box. Here's my lilac. We got... It was parsley, sage, rosemary, and thyme. So now we've got sage, rosemary, chives. I think there's a little bit of parsley left. But then some other stuff. Some really nice sage here. Catmint. And catmint. Okay, so here's the disaster. So... Hi! Um, got some tomatoes with a bite taken out of them. There's a couple hiding in there too. So this is regular mint. Cat mint back there as well. And we've got the... Um, couple different types of peppers here. I already took, I had a third type of pepper in here that I took out. Strawberries over there. This is the raspberry bush back here. And then there's another cat mint back there. But as you can see, the weeds just totally took over. And this is actually not as bad as it was. Um, it was, it was, believe it or not, it was worse than this. Um, I, I couldn't get in to the middle there for a while. And I've already knocked back the raspberry a few times, so... Um, let me see if I can get in and show you evidence of raspberry and you can see some of the cherry tomatoes in here. Very, very healthy. <laughs> um, yeah, here we go. This was, this was raspberry. Um, so I left for like a week and a half and then that was in. June? Yeah, I left, then I had COVID, and then I left again, and it just went to hell. So, um, <laughs> that's my garden this season. Ooh, I see more. I see more cherry tomatoes. This continually happens. I go over and pick them, and I walk to the other side of the yard, and I see more that were hiding somewhere. quite ready yet. Like I said, I don't know if we'll actually get more out of it, but I'll show you in here my strawberries. That one that the slugs ate. Oh, here's one that's not slug eaten and really not quite ready. So I'll try to give that one another day and the slugs will probably have it by morning, but survive. There's another one that's starting, but probably not going to make it because I think we're going to, we're going to frost too soon for that. So the, um, the strawberries here and one of the tomatoes, or actually maybe all of the cherry tomatoes over here were actually uh, volunteers this year from leftover from last year. This, for what it's worth, I kept inside for a long time and it was doing really well and then it got pretty sad so brought it out to see if I can revive it all right that's the garden tour thanks y'all